Welcome back to our YouTube channel. In today's video, we will see that how to fix target website not working on Safari. So if you ever encountering this frustrating problem, so don't worry, we have got you covered. In this video, we will walk you through the step-by-step -step solutions to get the website up and running smoothly on your Safari browser. So first step is to do, you can simply clear Safari cache and cookies. The first step is troubleshoot website issue on Safari is to clear your browser cache and cookies. These stores data can sometimes cause conflict and prevent website from loading correctly. To remove the cache and cookies in browser, you can simply see in a bottom, sorry, top left corner, a Safari icon. You can simply press this and after that click on settings. After that, here, click on Advanced, the last option, and scroll down and select the Show feature for web developers. After that, you will see, again, in a top side, a New Developer tab will be opened. You can simply press then, and after that, here you will see Empty Cache. You can simply press the Empty Cache to clear the browser cache and cookies. Right now, your browser cache and cookies is completely ruined. Then you can simply refresh the target website in Safari and then see that your issue is resolved or not. If not, you can simply move to our next step is update Safari browser. Ensure your Safari browser is up to date. Outdated version may lack compatibility with certain websites and then can need functionality issue. Updating a browser can often resolve this problem. So to update, you can simply Minimize the screen and after that open the app store. After that go to the update tabs. And here check that the Safari is need to update or not. If not, you can simply move to our next solution. So our next solution is disable extension. Browser extensions can sometimes interfere with website functionality. Disable any extension you have installed on Safari and then try accessing the website again to see if the issue is resolved or not. To disable the extension, again oh, click on the Safari icon and after that click on settings and then click on X. extension you will see here. Right now I don't have any extension yet. If you have any extension you can simply try to disable for some times or you can completely remove them if it is not for you or not helpful for you. After that, you can simply cut this page and then refresh your target website again. So if still you are encountering this frustrating issue, so it's time to contact the target customer support. You can simply scroll down in your target website and here you will find the help center. Here you can simply click on the contact us button to contact the target customer support. Here you can simply select your topic. Yeah. If you have not find your topic here, so you can simply open a new tab and here type target customer support. And after that, the target customer support official website will be open. Here, they have many options to contact with the customer associative. Like, first one, you can simply press this center button to visit the website. Second one, using email. And third one is direct call. So you can direct call the customer's associative and then provide them all the steps you already taken in your issue. And then wait for some times that they can provide you the essential steps. And there you have it. By following these steps, you should be able to troubleshoot and fix a website not working on Safari. Remember, patience and persistence are key when dealing with technical issues. So if you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more tech tips and tutorial. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.